Uh, Andy, feels like uh, it's a complete repeat occurrence every week. Another two goals, how are you feeling? Buzzing. Um, obviously happy you get the two goals. More importantly again, we got the win. Um, I think it was a bit similar to Tuesday night, you know, the way, the way they come at us. Um, crashing in the box and that, and I think obviously we um, dealt with it great. You know, the back line, different class. Days in football don't really come any better than this. Um, I wasn't particularly busy today, but uh, you know, played a good team today. Really, um, you know, came into the day second in the table. Uh, so it wasn't an easy game. You know, it's been a tough week. Played two very direct teams, and we've come away with six points, and we're delighted. You know, it really feels like we're sort of starting to build a bit of momentum, and we're kind of getting on a bit of a roll now. So um, yeah, hopefully this is uh, this, look, this is just a start for us, and I think uh, you know the early early season games when we're sort of saying, oh, we're trying to we're starting to gel, blah blah blah. I think people can really see that we are starting to gel and things are coming together nicely for us. Uh, over the moon to be honest, you know, first half full debut in front of the fans at home. Um, yeah, it meant a lot to me, so absolutely buzzing with the goal and the win of course. And you know, quite some celebration scenes as well today, your first goal for Bradford City. Uh, how good is that to, to get uh, off the mark? Yeah, it's, an abs it's a massive confidence piece, you know, before going to international duty, hopefully I'll be able to take my country to the European Championship. So. Yeah, it's a massive confidence piece and hopefully it'll be, there'll be more towards the end of the season. To be fair, it was a bit similar to Tuesday night. Um, obviously, the, this time they were all grappling us and uh, I, was, I managed to get free and I got across them and then obviously I got a flick on it. It's gone. And another, great, so another great ball from Dickie Lake. <laughs> oh. Another sort of mishap as well in the celebration I saw from a distance. Oh, <laughs> honestly, Tuesday night you get stuck in the net. Tonight, today our cleansman on the concrete. I'm scratching my belly off it. Uh, nah, but... A great celebration. Who does a cleansman on the concrete? <laughs> <laughs> doesn't seem to stop you though. Talk us through the second one as well. Second one. Uh, Tyree, great balls, you know what I mean? All I had to do was put it in the net. I was in the right place at the right time. Everyone wants each other to do well. Like, um, you know, Cookie's banging goals and left, right and centre. I couldn't be happier for him. He, he deserves it. He works hard every week. You know, Defenders, Timmy's coming today. Uh, Rom's been absolutely class. Uh, unfortunately, he got knocked Tuesday night. Timmy slotted in today, you know, and we're all just delighted for him. You know, he's got his chance. He took it today. Foldy as well as another one. You know, had a tough start to the season. We're not playing, but he's coming. He's been brilliant. Rides has been brilliant as well. Um, you know, it's just there's a team full of quality in there, but they're full of good lads as well. And everyone's sort of got each other's back, and everyone wants each other to do well, which is so important in football. Something I've never experienced before, but um, I'm absolutely, honestly, loving every minute of it. Out of all my loans so far, I'm saying that I'm enjoying this one the most and I've only been here about two weeks so I'll be looking forward to see what the season holds and now uh, yeah, I'll be looking to see the fans at the stadium every every couple of weeks. No, it's incredible, it's, especially when we're doing well and, and we're winning the game and stuff, it's, uh, it's fantastic to see. Um, that many people and making the noise that they do. I really thought as well the, the away end at Tranmere was was probably the best that we've uh, best that we've had all season so far. Um, but yeah, it's 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 great. Turn to see around, him, look at this dog who gets sent off. What an idiot! Get on him. Oh, I can't, one. I can't be doing that. I can't time. be doing that. <laughs> Uh, last but not least, uh, I you've been learning Spanish. Is there any chance we could have? Uh, how, how do you feel a little bit in Spanish? Uh, you know what? I, I, so okay, so I've, I've been having a weekly Spanish lesson for the last ten weeks, and last week I plucked up the courage to ask how to say up the chickens in Spanish. I thought Florence is my Spanish tutor, and I thought I'm not going to get her to tell me how to say the F word. We've not got that type of relationship yet. So <laughs> apparently, up it the is. Uh, <laughs> Did you get that? Oh my word! <laughs> Phenomenal! Um, so I've been reliably informed that Arriba los pollos. Mm. Stop the chickens. So uh, yeah, that's it. It absolutely is because I googled it before. Yes! In case you didn't yes! know. <laughs> just in case you didn't know, I was like, I'm going to slide <laughs> that in there. Finally, let's have a little look at that bottle there. Oh, it suits you. It suits you. <laughs> Spot on, mate. Thanks very much.